already do though come here real quick you know i like to grab on your neck <laughs> and you know get you turned on and shit like that you know what i'm saying i know this shit a little spot okay. um, i gotta get you ready another video here today man thank y'all so much for tuning in and clicking on my video and as always i love y'all and i appreciate y'all man but before we even hop into any video today i need to stop what y'all doing right now and pause this video and hit that like button right now we on the road to 5k subs right now y'all this right here is our current sub count so what i need y'all to do right now is stop whatever y'all doing and share this video with at least two people y'all know i'm with the one and only reg lee to the right of me right now man or to the left of them but to the right of me you know what i'm saying and we picked up this from walmart man i feel like this is gonna be a real w uh addition to our room and shit like that sorry again rg's all on the camera and shit but like i just wanted to show y'all what it looked like real quick man it's like a little like whiteboard calendar type of thing show them the markers that come with it and shit like that you feel me it come with two markers and it come with some magnets yeah. and 10 of these little push pins. Yeah, bro. So I feel like this is going to be a real W. We just picked this up today. And I also feel like this is going to be a real W for, like, accomplishing goals. Because, like, you know, we was talking about how we're going to, like, write out different video ideas that we got planned for y'all on this whiteboard and shit. And, like, put it up, like, on our bed or, like, you know, by our dresser and shit like that. So, you know, every day we wake up, we see it. And, you know, we get motivated to do videos because we're like, all right, let's do this today. Let's do that today. So, you know, I'm excited for this. I feel like it's going to be way more of a, like, an organization type of thing mm -hmm. with the YouTube videos compared to, you know, how it's been. Yeah, it's cool. I got some little cool sayings on here, too. Yeah, most definitely. They got one that say goals. They got one that say important. They got one that say uh, plan it. And that's important, man. Always plan it. Plan ahead, mm -hmm. man. And then a uh, day off. Hey, we all need a day off, chat. I ain't gonna lie. Day night. Day night. Hey, man. Day night be fire. No lie. Mm -hmm. And then they got one that say uh, appointment. Yeah, they got a lot of stickers on here and stuff, man. So this yeah. this is a W. Yo, I need a retwist so bad right now, y'all. Sorry if my hair looking kind of walky, bro. Cause like I went to bed without my boo boo cap slash do rag last night, man. And I woke up looking like what R E G say, Psycho Bob. <laughs> so, you know what I'm saying? Like my fault is my hair looking all walky, but I'm gonna get my retwist done real soon, man. Hopefully my girlfriend come through either tomorrow or the next day. You know what I'm saying? To get my hair done, cause I've been really wanting a retwist and a haircut, bro. Cause I'll be trying to keep up tight with like getting my hair cut bro and my hair done because i ain't gonna lie chat like your hair is the most important part of your body i feel like bro that's the first thing people really notice mm -hmm. when they see you obviously you know maybe people might notice your shoes and shit because i look at shoes too when i just look at a person and shit but like i feel like your hair it comes in a big play like you know how a person look at you how a person think about you and shit your hair is part of you so, you know what i'm saying like when my hair don't feel good i don't feel good you feel me like comment down below if y'all feel the same way y'all make sure y'all follow me on twitch man i'm gonna put my twitch right here i always say this in damn near every video but i need you to follow me on twitch man i'm doing all these lit streams and i want to have a couple people pop out on stream man like maybe some rappers some singers some people that's like doing other occupations that what i'm doing so you know i could promote what they doing and shit like that because i really want to switch it up bro i want to have the streams as lit as possible and i also want to bring in different audiences you know what i'm saying i feel like if i bring other people on stream then you know it'll bring out people different audiences people actually pop out because you know they like oh yeah this person gonna be on stream tonight it might be lit so y'all definitely gotta pop out on stream if y'all are my real supporters and if y'all don't want to pop out on stream just pop out to the stream bro you know what i'm saying it's gonna be in the description as well but we've been going crazy on twitch y'all we're on that road to affiliate right now no cap like we're on the road to 5k on youtube road to affiliate on twitch affiliate is like you know we get paid and we get subs and you know people can donate and shit like that so that's gonna be lit it's gonna be a good feeling to actually get paid off twitch and 
and YouTube. No cap. I really need y'all there, though. No cap, bro. I'm going to put my Twitch in the description, bro. You know what I'm saying? All my real supporters pop out. Hey, man, I need to see more people active in the chat, though, bro. You know what I'm saying? Because I be seeing a lot of people comment in the chat, but, like, not as much as I should see, bro. You know what I'm saying? So, if y'all watching this right now, bro, y'all got to support me on the Twitch. I literally post some of my YouTube every time I go live. But, like, if y'all don't know when I go live, follow me on Instagram. So, I'm going to put my Instagram right here. And my Instagram is also going to be in the description down below. But I always post something on Instagram when I go live on Twitch. So y'all know when I go live, bro. You know what I'm saying? But follow my Twitch, bro. And if y'all follow my Twitch, make sure y'all turn on my post notification on my Twitch. So you know when I go live. So you'll get the notification. A lot of people have been telling me I should start streaming on Kick, though, y'all. What y'all think about that? Because I've been hearing a lot of people say, like, Kick pays better than Twitch. And, like, you know, it's easier to hit uh partner with kick on you know kick so you know what i'm saying let me know what y'all think about that if i should you know switch it up sometime and you know stream on kick every now and then because i've been hearing it od bro and it's like with me if i hear some shit i was telling you this shit the other day if i hear some shit constantly consistently then it's like i'm gonna just have to damn near do it bro because it's like that's a sign you know what i'm saying if people keep saying they want to see me on some shit then i'm gonna have to mess around and do it so i might mess around on stream on twitch sometime and then stream on kick sometime too you know what i'm saying it'll bring in a different audience because not all people use twitch but mm -hmm. some people use kick you know so what y'all think about that chat y'all think i should stream on kick every now and then comment down below would you still talk to me if like i was like some crazy ass like church boy you know what i'm saying like crazy religious like because don't get me wrong like i'm religious and shit you know what i'm saying i believe in god but like not od like some people is you know what i'm saying yeah type shit like um these uh what is it celibate and yeah. shit like that like how would you still talk to me if i was like that or like nah <laughs> No. No. Nah. <laughs> I figured you would say no, bro. I ain't gonna lie, bro. Yeah, but I would you you good though, cause I ain't gonna lie. If you was like that, I wouldn't talk to you either. Cause like, bro, I couldn't do it, bro. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I gotta be lit, bro. Ain't no why. Yeah. <laughs> I was thinking about that one movie, uh what's it called? Um I fell in love with a church girl. You yeah. ever see that movie? I love it. Yeah, that was a W movie. But I remember she was, uh, she kept making that nigga wait, bro. Like, she would not let that nigga, uh, crack. And, like, it Did was... Did he keep waiting? Nah, he kept waiting, bro, because, like, he really fell in love with the girl. But, like, bro, this nigga was messing around with mad females before, you know, he talked to, he found her, you know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? But, like, while he was with her and shit, he would have, like, females calling his phone. But, like, he wouldn't even answer and shit, you feel me? And then eventually... You know, she was on some type of time, like, you know, I'm not about to, you know, talk to you on some type of time if you got all them females around and shit. So eventually the female stopped calling because, you know, he wasn't answering the phone mm -hmm. every time they pick up, like, you know, or he answered the phone every time they call like he usually do. And then, you know, he eventually fell in love with the church girl and she that made him wait. And then at the end of the movie, it was cool, bro, because, like, they got married and shit. And he was a pimp. I don't know. Or he, I don't know if he was a pimp or like a drug dealer. Either a pimp or a drug dealer. Either one, bro. But like um, at the end of the movie, he became a, a pastor. And oh, like really? you know, they had a baby and shit at the end of the movie. That's cute. He actually said and wait. The most dudes nowadays will not wait. If you tell a nigga to wait nowadays, this nigga gonna wait on you while with somebody else. Nah, no cap. That's nowadays though, bro. I feel like uh, it's more like likely back in the day. Like, you know, in the 80s, mm -hmm. 70s, 90s, and shit like that, for uh, people to, you know, be like that. You yeah. know what I'm saying? And they partner to still be okay with it. Yeah. Sorry, dude, though. Come here real quick. You know, I like to grab on your neck mm -hmm. and, you know, get you turned on and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? I know this your little spot. Mm -hmm. I gotta get you ready. Make sure y'all share this video with at least two people, man. We on that road to 5K right now. Also, don't forget to turn on my post notification bell so y'all know every time I upload.